What's up, y'all? It's Dead Doogie here, back in Borderlands 3 with another Proving Ground speedrun video. In this one, we're taking my man, Tiss a Cold Day in Hell Walker build through the trial of instinct. So, in addition to just being a, a showcase for the versatility of this build and its ability to, you know, do things like a speedrun, it's also a story of hate. I freaking hate all the creatures in the Borderlands universe, with the exception of Maurice. Everything else, I think, deserves to die. I particularly hate jabbers because they throw shit at you, which is just freaking rude. You know, flinging feces. Come on. Uh, I think spider ants are assholes, even though there are no spider ants in this. That was in the last video, which we talked about the asshole nature of spider ants. Uh, we're going to be going up some Saurians. Like I said, Maurice is the only one I like. The rest of them, total douches. Total, total douches. I particularly hate um, the, the jabbers with the money, the thieving jabbers. They're usually a pain in the ass when you're trying to do a speed run because they generally take a lot of effort to kill. But with this freeze and shoot build, it's really a joke. I, I'm just surprised that some of this stuff is doable as a speedrun with just this shotgun build. Usually for speedruns or prior to um, Mayhem 10, if you wanted to speedrun something with Zane, it would generally be a, uh, a heavy build, right? So uh, rocket launchers, that kind of thing. To do a gun speed run would be more challenging with Zane, but with his new skill tree, the many, many changes to the sandbox, for example, the buffing of um, the Hellwalker, and now access because of the skill tree to action skill activate and action skill end. Anointments, like Zane can do every and anything. So he kind of feels like Amara. In this build to me in this run he feels amara-esque um one of the youtubers i actually watch is lazy data he has an amara hellzerker build and this feels better than that and you know his hellzerker build looks like it's a lot of fun but i just this one is just so much better because our accuracy is so much better than what amara is capable of doing look how tight that reticle is man like we're sniping from across the map because i'm trying to stay out of the water so i don't suffer um, the Let's elemental effects from being inside of the water. So, you know, look at the range that we're doing idiots. all of this damage. Pretty sweet. Pretty, pretty damn sweet. So, yep, here we are. Douchebag Syrians. And for the record, Maurice does not care that we kill them because Syrian culture, as I understand it, you know, you're supposed to kill and dominate your enemies. Alright, back to the shit throwing jabbers. Oh, I love fucking up their shit. I'm on fire! But not literally. Uh, there's this thread on the forums about the brain dead nature of Zane, and I don't believe in that shit. If you think it's brain dead, you're a friggin' idiot. Sorry. You know, there are stupid in the world, stupid people in the oh, world that say right. stupid shit, and that's some stupid shit to say, because you don't have to play any particular way, you know. You can make it more challenging for yourself. You can choose non-meta options uh, and do what you want to do and just have fun with it, you know. So I'm trying to do a speed run, so I'm just doing what I need to do to get this thing done in under five. Finally got a Monarch. I want to thank MDB for hooking me up. I didn't have to farm Kilovolt. I hate that douchebag. Oh, talk about another asshole in the game. So this speed run, courtesy of MDB. I've tried all the weapons, but the Monarch just worked out better. So uh, in his first phase, the, the tyrant, the boss, he's resistant to fire because he's fire when he initially spawns, which is why I switched to the Monarch, a kinetic version. And then now that he's dead, uh, went ahead and switched back to the Hellwalker because the whole point is to showcase the Hellwalker. So, so that's the end of it. We did it in under five. Um, Oogle and Ogle at my gear. 
and I will catch you guys in the next one. Thank you for watching.